we were to use the same peak-to-peak -peak voltage of 50 Hz as found in domestic supply, we would experience an electric shock. The magic is in the operational frequency of these devices. The frequency output generated by these devices starts from 50 kHz. Note that this is 50,000 Hz and not 50 Hz. This higher frequency avoids the undesired electromuscular stimulation, which in turn avoids electric shocks. Because of this principle, electrical surgical devices have high currents at high voltage, therefore high power, and can thus be put through the human body without causing any harm either to the internal organs or nervous system. Remember that the first electrosurgical unit was used by a neurosurgeon, and that provides an idea of the level of confidence and inherent safety of such devices. Thanks to this, these devices have been in widespread use in the medical and aesthetic world since the early 1930s. Today, the use of voltaic arcs in medicine include electrocoagulation, meaning coagulation of blood vessels, hemostasis, the destruction of soft tissues, the cutting of a variety of tissues in the operating theatre. Additionally, in aesthetics, electric arcs with high frequency currents have applications in skin tightening, the removal of benign moles and benign skin lesions, tattoo removal, red veins removal and more. Thank you for watching.